what's up guys it's your babe and i recently learned that they dropped a sneak peek trailer for the new wallace and gromit movie and there hasn't been one of those in a really long time i don't know why i'm insisting on holding my mark i have a hanger um but wallace and gromit is like a nice little favorite for me i kind of I grew up in South Africa and we kind of had this weird mix of American TV and British TV. So I kind of saw a lot of both. And I, one of the things that I really took enjoyment from was the British sense of humor, British stuff. And Wallace and Gromit kind of fell into a family favorite. And we kind of just loved them. And I remember watching it from such a young age. So it's kind of, it's, it's exciting to hear that they're going to do something more. And I'm just, I want to get back into it. Because I know that they are probably going to bring back one of the greatest cinematic villains to ever exist. And I really hope we get to see him in this trailer. Nifty odd jobbing robot. Call me Norbot. This is my latest invention. Pleased to meet you, Master Grommet. A smart gnome. Well, go on, just put him through his little paces. He's voice activated. Vengeance most powerful. Oh, that's so cool. Just, I was kind of, that thing was creepy. But that's exciting. I got a lot to say. Um, I kind of hope that they've kind of stuck to some claymation roots. That's what made Wallace and Gromit so great in the first place was the use of claymation love the detail it looks like um if you buy if you build like warhammer models and you like to give it like diorama backgrounds it looks like the plants and the fake grass and stuff that you would buy for those dioramas so that looks pretty cool um if that's something that they've sat and kind of like CGI'd in, they've done a good job at it. I love it. Um. Hi. That is horrifying. That is terrifying. It's, um. It looks like it's going to watch you in your sleep. I'm your nifty odd jobbing robot. Call me Norbot. This is my latest. Gromit gets it. Gromit. No, Gromit gets it. Gromit knows. Gromit is fully aware that this thing is gonna haunt his dreams. It's convention. Pleased to meet you, Master Gromit. Yeah. He knows. And you know he knows. <laughs> but the one thing I do really want to just sit on for a second is this lovely moment right here. A comb and keys. A tape measure and the iconic chicken disguise. I wonder if I can just all of this it's so great to see these references come through, especially especially the tape measure because that was like how he did everything was with this tape measure. The only thing that's missing in this box 
is his gun. I wonder if he's gonna bring out his gun again in this in this vengeance mode of whatever. I just I love it. I love the attention to that. I love the attention to keeping to the fact that it's only got four fingers because these characters only have four fingers for whatever reason. I just I love it. I think it's brilliant. And then also like credit to them, the scene of the net crack. Horrifying. Absolutely horrifying. I love it. It's gonna be great. Um, they just... Oddman, um, I don't know who they're working with for this one. Hang on. Let's see. Who are you working with? It just says BBC Netflix. Okay. Yeah, this guy this guy gets it. This guy gets it. Over here. The penguin is low key one of the top three cinematic villains of all time. I absolutely think it's gonna be great. It doesn't have to be special, it doesn't have to be phenomenal or anything. I just as long as it's your average Wallace and Gromit adventure, I think that's fine. I don't think I've ever been disappointed in a Wallace and Gromit movie. Yeah, there, there's one or two that weren't the greatest, but they don't need to be great. The thing about Wallace and Gromit is being able to tell a short story, or tell a story, and just go with it and have some tomfoolery and good old, like, animated physics for a good comedic laugh family friendly you know everyone can sit down and watch it and enjoy it and as long as they stick to that i think it's going to be great i love i already love it i really love the idea of the penguin coming back i wonder if the penguin was an ex-henchman to the penguin oh anyways that's it for that one i just wanted to share my love of all of Wallace and Gromit and show you guys these sneak peeks. I think it's really awesome. And that's about it for this. I'll catch you guys later.